Hey everybody, Chanel here from Feb Style. Um, today I am going to be doing a mascara, first time ever trying out, I guess. <laughs> I am trying the YSL Yves Saint Laurent Shocking Mascara. Um, I've never tried any of the YSL makeup products, so this is the first for me. Um, I did want to try the, the baby doll one that just came out, but unfortunately it hasn't come out in Canada yet. So I am going to try the Shocking Mascara first, and then once the other one comes out, hopefully I'll be able to do another video and uh, do a review on that one. So this is the first time I'm opening it. The brush is pretty cool. Um, it's kind of like the um, drugstore brushes that are uh, like a rubber brush. Uh, but not really. I don't know if you can see. But yeah, this is the brush. Um, yeah, so I'm going to just give it a go and see see how it is. The girl at the store said that it's supposed to make your eyelashes really full and thick. Um, I'm used to wearing like the Smashbox Full Exposure where um, it does the same thing but it also lengthens. Um, so yeah. So far so good. There's a fair amount of product going on. Um, it's not doing a very good job at separating my lashes, which I really look for in a mascara, but... There's one eye, and just do the bottom lashes. So now I'll just do the other eye here. Anyways, the first um, first eye was way better than this eye. For some reason, now my lashes are sticking together a lot. I guess a lot of product is coming out onto my lashes. Um, sometimes that's a good thing, but it kind of depends on the brush. So, yeah, I'll probably be taking <laughs> this eye off and uh, trying a different mascara just for today and be taking the YSL Shocking Mascara back. Love to give you another shot YSL, so hopefully your next mascara is a lot better. So I just wanted to do a follow-up um, for the end of the video. Um, I wore the Yves Saint Laurent Shocking on this eye all day. And then I actually, after I messed up on this eye, um, well not messed up, it was really clumpy, so I took off this eye. I actually used um, the Bobbi Brown Everything Mascara that was a sample that came um, that actually the guy at Sephora put in my bag when I got the YSL Shocking um, Mascara. So I decided to use this one on this eye um, and then I just kept this eye the same with the YSL Shocking. Um, and actually the Bobbi Brown um, Everything Mascara, uh, halfway through the day I went to the bathroom and I noticed that um, it was almost like smudging and like rubbing down here. Um, I know that she was saying that uh, at Sephora that the YSL Shocking is, um, uh, I guess, like, water resistant. So she was like, it's not waterproof, because I was like, I don't like waterproof mascara. Um, but she said it was water resistant. So this one actually, it held up really great, and it's kind of got like a rubbery texture. Um, the Bobbi Brown um, Everything Mascara is more like flaky, and um, I guess it smudges as well. So. Um, these are just, I guess, two of my first first impressions for mascaras. Um, I definitely, I don't know, the YSL one, like, it lasted great, but I really didn't like the applicator brush, um, just the way that it went on. Um, the Bobbi Brown mascara, I'll just show you guys what the applicator looks like. It's just kind of like your average, um, applicator brush. Um, I like this brush way better than the, the rubbery, um, 
one that the YSL Shocking was. Um, but yeah, this mascara wasn't as good. Um, what I should do is just trade the brushes, but I already went um, on my way to work and returned the YSL Shocking um, mascara. Um, unfortunately, it just didn't work out, but that's okay. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks, guys. Bye.